Chicago the land of many famous architecture, is home to one of the world's tallest skyscraper designed by a female-led architectural firm the Studio Gangs Architect. Jean Gang born in 1964 in Illinois, is the lead architect of the Gangs Architect. Her passion for architecture began from an early age while visiting sites with her father who was a civil engineer and by getting inspired from patterns her mother worked on as a tailor. Gang's ideas are mostly working in environment without exploiting its inhabitant. She has an idea to blend cities and landscapes together. One of her remarkable projects is Aqua. An 82-story multi-purpose skyscraper located in Chicago. Also the first skyscraper in Chicago to contain a hotel, condominiums, apartments and retail space. The curved concrete balconies of different shapes gives each floor a different musical rhythmic pattern. The exterior facades gives the visual sense of water, this the reason the structure is called the Aqua. Gang's career took a leap after the design of Aqua. Aqua was awarded the Skyscaper of the Year in 2009. WMS Boathouse at Clark Park in Chicago is also one of her designs. It is a two-story mechanically heated and cooled training center. The training center is utilized by the Chicago Rowing Foundation. Its spaces offer indoor and outdoor activities. Gang's motive behind the design was to capture the musical rhythm and movement of rowing. The roof of the structure resembles the time-lapse movement of rowing. The Arca Center for Social Justice was designed by Studio Gang's Architects is located in Kalamazoo College in Michigan. The main main purpose of the building was to bring the community together for topics related with social justice. The design provides a figurative extension of the trees in the adjacent grove landscape. The design has spaces which serves as various purposes such as a study center, meeting space and a space for any discussions. The triaxial plan connects to the residential neighborhood, the college campus and a native woodland groove. types of issues that architects are dealing with are multiplying and our practices are changing. You know, it used to be that architects really went building by building, but now we are involved in so many more important issues that are that are and were needed to help understand how will cities adapt, how will cities change for this changing climate and changing environment. The the population of the globe is expanding and there's more and more critical issues to address. The Chicago Biennial is a big exhibition that people can come to, they don't have to be architects, but anyone who's curious about space and shelter and even just, just what's going on in the world, um, architecture is such a great reflection of what culture is doing and, and so this is a snapshot of what architects are doing now and what kinds of things they're thinking about now. So I want people to expand their idea of what they think an architect is. Um, and I think by seeing these different practices from all over the world and the type of work they're engaging, um, it's really gonna expand the horizons of what people think architects do and what they can. Gang has been considered to have played a role model for women empowerment. She has inspired women to develop within the profession, 